morning. Happy Saturday, the 20th of April, 2024, from Sault Ste. Marie, Michigan. I'm down here by the Ashman Bay boat ramp, and I wanted to welcome the Wilfred Sykes in the town. Seems like it's a very rare treat when we get a daytime visit from her. So, I had to take advantage of that. I feel like I lucked out a little bit because she had two downbound salties ahead of her that held her up. So I guess uh, their pain is our gain. <laughs> it is, uh, I don't know if you can tell, it's pretty windy. Um, it's been snowing <laughs> off and on all morning. As the lake effect bands do, they kind of come and go. So luckily we are presently, as you can see, not getting any snow. But uh, not long ago, it was really snowing hard. Um, it's like 34 degrees, so it's not sticking at all. But uh, yeah, it's trying. And we are facing... Uh, not quite exactly into the wind, but we will be here shortly. Um, you can probably see my one annoyance with this spot is that wire that's going across the frame right there above the Sykes. <laughs> I really wish that wire wasn't there. It goes out to, uh, there's a couple little, I don't know what they are, little structures here in the, the canal that feeds the, the hydroelectric plant. I do not know the purpose of those structures though. Uh, uh, last time I looked on marine traffic, they were, the Sykes was making two and a half knots, which from what I understand is kind of their minimum speed without you know taking the engine. Like, I don't know if they have like a clutch system where they can like take it out of gear and then put it back into gear. I, I don't know. But, uh, and I only know that because very recently one of the river pilots wrote a little article about some questions he's seen. And he mentioned that. I think he mentioned the Sykes specifically as like a minimum speed of two and a half knots because they don't have a variable pitch propeller. It's a fixed pitch. And of course, they are running on steam there. So that's, uh, that's super cool. There aren't many, uh, vessels still doing steam. Sure is a classy lady though. Classy lady. So I might end up being quiet because she's... Uh, my, my hunch is that she doesn't want to tie up <laughs> and so they just want to go in. And so uh, it's currently a salty in the lock and I can't see from here. So I'll have to look on my phone to see if they're on the move or not. Ooh, that was a stout breeze. Nope, they are still... Oh no. They should be leaving the lock. They, uh, the, the salty Puna is in the lock right now and they had the tug Wyoming helping them and I see Wyoming is out which means Puna will be underway so the Wyoming can help them out so <laughs> perfect sense right but then they have to still cycle the lock so that's another once they get out it's almost 20 minutes just to cycle the lock so, so, yeah, I, I don't envision <laughs> I'll be talking the whole time and I, I think I might put it into hyper mode here. Otherwise, this will be a really long video. In fact, I should have looked while I was looking at marine traffic. I bet the Sykes is still doing the same. Yep, two and a half knots, so. The 
times wish I could uh, set the camera to follow, but I can't. <laughs> I gotta turn this down just a touch. Uh, the Sykes is coming from Marquette so we've, we've been lucky this year several trips from the Sykes already and last year we didn't have any until near the end of the season so we're definitely lucking out So I, I had to laugh a little bit because um, today is the 20th of April and there's been all kinds of advertisements on the radio and flyers around town, you know, from the, uh, the marijuana dispensaries with their, uh, their 420 sales. And uh, that's not my thing at all. But when I was driving here, I, I, have to, I drive past one and the parking lot was full. And then I just kind of snickered to myself, you know, like, you know, it's 420. I was expecting more green and less white. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Whew. That breeze just about made me take a step back. Wow. I think I'm going to engage the hyper mode here. Yeah, rather than just listen to me blather on or possible wind noise. So we'll speed this up. I'll throw in some kind of little music and then I'm sure I'll be back here uh, shortly. and we're back. I don't know if you can tell but it's just starting to snow and it looks like we have another band of lake effect coming our way here. You can kind of see it. We're facing almost directly into the wind right now. Oh yeah. They're like little tiny pellets of snow. It's like micro hail. <laughs> We're about getting to where she's going to start being obscured. Ooh, yeah, those uh, sting the face. I'm glad I have my sunglasses on. Oh, wow. 
Yeah, that, that's some stuff right there. Gonna about do it for me. Oh yeah! Woo! <laughs> wow! Look at that queen of the lakes. Doesn't phase her a bit. I think this has probably gone on long enough, so <laughs> I think I'm pretty much going to call it. Hope you're having a great day. It's spring, so I'm back to saying I hope you're staying warm. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'll be back next time with Argo, I'm sure. And more ships. Have a great day. See you soon.